Excel is not meant for creating worksheets and making calculations only. Sorting the data in a meaningful manner, filtering it according to your requirement, conditional formatting and drawing charts are the powerful features. Excel offers to analyze data. When you sort information in a worksheet, you can see data the way you want and find values quickly. Sorting data. MS Excel rearranges data in ascending or descending order on the basis of the contents of a particular column that is called sorting. You can sort a table in alphabetical order of names. You may want to sort marks in descending order to analyze the merit of students. Let us make a worksheet and store names and total marks obtained by students in the final examination. Notice the table is made according to roll numbers. Now, want to sort this according to the column names in alphabetical order. To sort the data, to sort the data follow these steps. Select the data range that you want to select. Click on data tab in the main menu. Select on the sort option in the sort and filter group. The sort dialog box will appear. Click on sort by drop down list triangle. It displays all the fields from the range. Select the field on which you want to sort data. In our worksheet, Names field is to be selected. Click on Order drop-down list arrow. Select A to Z to sort in alphabetical order. Click on OK. Excel sorts the data and displays the result. Isn't it simple? Notice the changes in the worksheet. The names are sorted in alphabetical order A to Z and all the other column values are shifted and rearranged accordingly. Names can be sorted in descending order by selecting Z to A in order list. In the same way, you can sort the data according to any numeric column. Caution! Remember, Excel rearranges data in the same cell range. So if you want to preserve the previous arrangement of data also, then copy data to some other location before sorting. Filtering. The filter feature is an easy and quick way to find a specific set of data in a data range. Data is filtered through some specified condition and Excel displays only those rows that fulfill the condition. It temporarily hides rest of the data in the range. Filtering does not rearrange the data. Auto filter. Use the auto filter feature in Excel 2010 to hide everything in a table except the records you want to view. Filtering displays a subset of a table that is easy to manage. Click inside a table, then choose Filter in the Sort and Filter group of the Data tab or press Ctrl plus Shift plus L. Filter arrows appear beside all the column headings. Click the filter arrow beside the column heading for the column you want to filter. Excel displays a drop-down list which includes one of each unique entry from the selected column. Remove the check mark from the select all to deselect all items in the list. Select the check box from the entry you want to filter and then click OK. Notice that the filter arrows on filtered columns take on a different appearance to indicate that a filter is in use. Excel displays only the records that match your selections. Here, in our worksheet, it is displaying data only for roll numbers 1 to 15. Clear a filter. Click the drop-down arrow in the column from which you want to clear the filter. Choose Clear Filter Form or click Clear option in the Sort and Filter group. The filter will be cleared from the column. The data that was previously hidden will be on display once again. To instantly clear all filters from your worksheet, Click the Filter command on the Data tab. Advanced Filtering You can search for data that contains an exact phrase, number, date using the Advanced Filtering features. Using Advanced Text Filters Let us learn how to use text filters. We will open the same worksheet. For searching exact phrase, Aditya, in column names, will display only row showing the name result of Aditya. Searching for the name starts with A will display all the names starting with A. From the Data tab, click the Filter column. Clip the drop-down arrow in the column you want to filter. In this example, 
we will filter the names column to view only a specific name. Select text filters and then equals and enter the name you want to view or select the name from the drop down list. The search results will appear automatically. Advanced text filters can be used to display more specific information as you have seen several options to text filters. Equals displays the cells that contain the same words you specified. Does not equal display the cells that does not contain the words you specified. Begins with displays the cells that begin with an alphabet or word you specified. Ends with displays the cells that end with an alphabet or word you specified. Contains displays the cells that contains an alphabet of word you specified. Does not contain displays the cells that does not contain a word you specify. For example, you can see the result of students whose names start with A using the option begin with. Or you can search for students having any particular surname using the option ends with. Using advanced number filters. Advanced number filters allow you to manipulate number data in different ways. For example, in a worksheet of exam grades, you could display the top and bottom numbers to view the highest and lowest scores. In this example, we'll display only the data of students having percentage greater than 90. Click somewhere within the data range. From the data tab, click the filter command. Click the drop down arrow in the column of numbers you want to filter. In this example, we'll filter the percentage column to view results of only those students who scored greater than 90%. Choose number filters to open the advanced filtering menu. Choose a filter. In this example, we'll choose greater than to see the names of the students who scored greater than 90%. Enter a number 90 or choose 90 from the drop down list to the right of filter and press OK. This will display results of only those students who scored greater than 90%. Let us observe several options to filter numbers. Equals displays the cells that contain the same value you specified. Does not equal displays the cells that does not contain the value you specified. Greater than displays the cells that contain greater value than what you specified. Greater than or equal to displays the cells that contain the same or greater value than what you specified. Less than displays the cells that contain lesser value than what you specified. Less than or equal to displays the cells that contain the same or lesser value than what you specified. Between displays the cells that contain values between the two values you specified. Top 10 displays the cells that contain the top 10 values. Above average it calculates the average and displays the cells that contain above average data. Below average, it calculates the average and displays the cells that contain below average data.